Hello, good day to you. It's uh, Talking Ready and a story that, <laughs> yes, is very interesting. You remember the uh, the UC people, they had a 20 quid upgrade, didn't they? They got paid uh, extra 20 quid a week and uh, basically this was to appease the many people that were claiming it who were basically what I would call normal um, and they were claiming it because of the pandemic. Well, they've discovered, oh dear, it's not enough to live on. Let's give them all 20 quid a week. But we'll say, sod the other lot. They can all suffer. Well, here's a story you, you'll really like. Yep, this story, 20 quid a week for the upgrade for... Uh, uh, out of work disability benefits that we don't get because they wouldn't do it. Well, it's now been discovered the government's own benefit advisors have told ministers that it is in- increasingly unattainable for them to refuse to pay out those on out of work disability benefits the temporary increase of 20 quid a week. Uh, obviously you know that the uh, the in- increase in standard allowance of U- UC was announced on 20th of March by the Chancellor as a result of the pandemic and it will last 12 months. But ministers have insisted that they cannot make the same increase quickly or safely <laughs> safely <laughs> to those on employment and support allowance and a JSA, job seekers allowance. Well, now, members of the Social Security Advisory Committee in a letter to the Pension Secretary, Teresa Coffey, Miss Cup of Coffey, said, I haven't done that joke for ages, have I? Uh, They said that they are of a strong view that it is increasingly untenable for this group of claimants to be excluded and to continue to have a lower level of income than those receiving UC and working tax credit. The committee's interim chairman, Liz Says, also calls in the letter for changes to housing benefit, the benefit cap and how the government is communicating changes to Social Security uh, during the crisis. Obviously then they lick ass because they say the committee also does praise of the extraordinary work the government have done to make major changes to the benefit system to provide immediate financial support to millions oh, no. of out of work employed and self employed people. I'm going to cry in a minute. I'm going to cry. Oh my god. What a load of bullshit. A DWP spokesperson refused to respond to the committee's requests but they said in a statement get this we are doing whatever it takes to ensure people are supported through these unprecedented times including injecting 6.5 billion into the welfare system and rolling out income protection schemes mortgage holidays and additional support for renters we have experienced a surge in demand since mid-march and universal credit has enabled us to increase payments at pace whilst maintaining the stability of the welfare system overall. We estimate that 2.5 million households on universal credit will benefit immediately from the 20 quid a week increase in the standard allowance. We have also increased our other entitlements such as local housing allowance to better support those across all benefits. Anyway, so that's the uh, the article. I hope you enjoyed that. It's very interesting. And as, you, as we all know, we ain't going to get the 20 quid a week, so don't worry about it. <laughs> so have a good day. And uh, bye for now. This is a quick video just to tell you about this button, the join button. You may not have noticed it, but it is now on the front page, right next to the subscribe button. <laughs> So if you're not subscribed, then uh, you would I would appreciate you doing that. But if you are, so of course you could take it one step further by becoming a member, and it's a very good system. It's integrated into YouTube, so everything in there, 
But essentially, it's it's just like Patreon. <laughs> and but if you become a member, you have certain benefits that you can uh, you know benefit from. <laughs> You've got some benefits that you can benefit from. <laughs> What can you get? Well, you know, you get priority viewing, you get uh, members only stuff, you get some discount on merchandise, and of course, uh, if you are lucky, you may even get some free stuff as well for being a member. So, uh, it's very easy to do. Just click the button and fill in all the details, and of course, you'll become one of a select few. Now, I want to just reiterate for anybody who's thinking I can't watch videos anymore, I have to pay. No, everything remains free. And of course, there is no compulsion for you to do that. If you don't want to or you cannot afford it, it doesn't matter because everything remains free. Obviously not the benefits though. Because they're not free. <laughs>